We've got a lot of hostiles inside, agents. They're holding Clear. Dr. Candle and her staff. We need those personnel back in, at the base go. so we can get the we medical wing back. functional. We'll hold here to cover your back. to the security system, I might be able to find Candle's location. Hatched in. Let's see what I can find. Can you see the CCTV feed? Looks like Candle and her staff are being forced to treat their wounded. That's the only reason they're still alive. Looks like they've got people upstairs, in a restaurant. There's a lot of these guys, but if you use cover, you should be able to pick them off without making yourself a target. They ain't getting away. Hey, what was that? Keep looking. Additional hostiles detected. Additional hostiles detected. Candle and her staff are still upstairs, stashed in the kitchen at Kobe's.
Word is that they've really trashed the place. It would have broken my dad's heart to see it go to hell like this. We used to watch games there together. I think it's better my folks didn't live to see any of this. But then I think about all the people doing their best to keep going. That's who we do this for, Agent. Go get them. To get to Kobe's, you'll have to pass by some contaminated areas. There used to be plenty of sick people being treated there before they got shot. So be careful. Detected. Party's taking heavy fire from the roof. They can't move until you get up there and take down that gunner. We're pinned down! There's no way we'll make it across alive unless someone can get up there and take out the big guns. All yours, Agent. Escort. We have an agent on the roof. Has Candle made it to your position? Affirmative. She and her staff just arrived. As soon as the hostiles on the roof are gone, we'll get her across safely.
additional hostiles incoming. across. Candle and all staff are counted for. No casualties. We're off to a good start, agents. Wish I could have had your back out there, but I think we make a hell of a team anyway. When you get back to the base, we'll talk to Candle and we'll see what she can do for us. Don't be taking unnecessary risks. Well, look who it is. Thanks for getting me out of the garden. I've been in some hostile work environments before, but Jesus. Of course, it's not like this place is gonna win any prizes either. Antique equipment, zero staff, patients lining up out the door. This isn't gonna cut it. We're doing the best we can, Dr. Candle. Any suggestions you might have, I'm happy to listen. I know, I know, beggars, choosers, all that crap. What matters is beating this thing, but I can't do that without knowing more about it. And here's a good place to start.
Sarah is pretty sure Dr. Gordon Amherst had something to do with the outbreak. God. That asshole. Saw him present a paper at Columbia once, he nearly started a riot. He's part of this? I need to talk to him. Anything of his you can find. Notebooks, laptops, close personal friends, I need that too. And we need to talk about live samples and antibodies. You're gonna be busy. And you'll be? Fixing this. Saving lives. Now if you'll excuse me, I'll get started. The upgrades look great. If we live through this, I want you working in my lab. Finally, a clinic. Gotta start somewhere. We've got enough staff to start tending to the public, but we've got our work cut out for us. Hey, I can see you need better gear. Well, so you're a division agent, huh? Great. Now, uh, don't dwell on all the death and carnage around you or the fact that so many have tried to do what you're about to attempt and failed and died what surely must have been a horrible death. Sure, they have more support than you do now, but so what? Fate's random and heartless. Nothing you can do about that. Stay positive. I'm just, uh, real glad it's gonna be you out there in the field and not me. But I'll let you know what we got, okay? Be here forever. 